As a creative, we all know how important having the right type of people in our life is. In this video, we'll be discussing five types of people you need in your life as a creative. The first type of people I believe you need in your life as a creative is a mentor or the mentors. Having a mentor or someone to look up to plays a very vital role in your life as a creative. First, you get to believe that your dream and aspiration is possible. Secondly, you get access to professional tips that saves you a lot of time from trial and error. To me, having a mentor is very, very important and has a lot of advantage to you as a creative. The second type of people you need in your life as a creative is the cheerleader or the motivator. We all need that friend that celebrates every of our wins, reminds us of how far we have come in our career and things we have been able to achieve so far in our career. As creatives, it is very easy for our ambitions to rob us of our coin blessings, but having friends like this or people like this around you helps you to appreciate where you are helps you to stay motivated, especially when you lose interest because definitely there will be a point that you lose interest, you lose the passion. But having these people that reminds you how far you have come, things you have sacrificed, what you have achieved, and people inspire, sometimes keeps you going. Sometimes that is the things that keeps you pushing and keep you moving. So when you find this type of people around you, please appreciate them. Don't take them for granted because they are really, really, really hard to find. The third type of people you need in your life as a creative is a critic. As a creative, it is very important to have that type of friends or people around you that gives you genuine constructive criticism without sugarcoating anything. These individuals help you to become a better version of yourself as a creative. They help you not to settle for the public hypes and adulations. You know, sometimes when you start hearing things like your work is so dope, your work is so crazy, sometimes a lot of us will settle for these hypes that we stop seeking for knowledge, we stop improving, we start believing that we are the best. But having this type of friends that also tell you the truth that there's room for improvement helps you become a better version of yourself. So if you have friends like this, Please don't see them as enemies. See them as people that play a very vital role in your life as a creative as well. So appreciate them and don't see them as enemy. The first type of people you need in your life as a creative is the networker. This type of people broadcast your name, sell you and your service at every little opportunity they get. They never get tired of introducing you to their friends, colleagues and family. But one thing is that it is very, very easy to mistake these people for talkative. Sometimes you take them for granted because, you know, they talk too much or, you know, you start taking what they are doing for you for granted. I actually have friends like this. They always introduce me to them. They always talk about me in a way that will even make the person want to, you know, check me out, check my Instagram out, check my Twitter handle out, but I don't take them for granted. I always try to appreciate them, to make them see that I'm grateful for what they are doing for me or, you know, the kind of personality they have. The fifth type of people you need in your life as a creative is the entrepreneur. These are the people you ask for advice when it comes to the business aspect of creativity. As creative, most of us started our career as a hobby before realizing that there is a business aspect of creativity, which makes migrating from the hobby aspect to the business aspect very, very challenging. But having this type of friends that you can ask for business advice regarding things like negotiation, contracts, and other things, makes your whole life as a creative very very easy so if you have this type of friends already please keep them like appreciate them appreciate the role they play in your life and don't take them for granted because they are actually of a great help to you as a creative and that's that for five types of people you need in your life as a creative surrounding yourself with people like this can make a very big difference in your creative career and creative pursuits so if you already have this type of people in your life already please don't take them for granted Make sure you appreciate them, you, also, you make them see how you value them and that you appreciate the role they play in your life as a creative. On this channel, we discuss creative journey and creative mental health. If this is your first time coming across my content, please do wait to subscribe to my channel for you to see more amazing content like this. Thank you so much.